in a world where nothing seems normal anymore. One thing is constant. Asian families. So you call him Papa? In this unique series, we enter the lives of four middle-class families. In these changing times, if you don't like me, you can get out of the house. Relationships are not that straightforward. <laughs> and traditional roles are reversed. If he's not my husband, I don't think I will hire him. The truthful exploration of family life. A new season of The Family Affair. Previously, you whine and then take your toys away. No, first I want to. You whine and then take your toys away. Okay, stop fighting. Hey, it's not this dosa, Mary. You can't have my masala, sorry. You have to get up and sit. Hey, come here. Is it late? You don't go there and sit in the garden and take the toys. New stepdad Vikrant Misra attempts to discipline his five and a half year old stepson, Raghav. But he has met with very little success. <laughs> Disciplining Raghav is the biggest point of contention between the newly married couple. Yeah, cool. Okay, have this bite, then I'm going to get. Why, why can't he get it himself? What is your problem? Why do you both have to fight? Yeah. Aside from grappling with being an instant dad, Vikrant has yet to gain the approval of his mother-in-law. Lavanika's mother, or Nana, is still coming to terms with her daughter's second marriage. See, Lavanika has always been a very, very independent girl. It's difficult as an Indian mother to accept and to go along with these choices, but that's how it has to be. Hello. Hey, how are you? Good. I realized that, you know, the more I'll push her, the more rebellious she'll become and she'll go into that non-acceptance stage. So I've just let her be. Time brings everything around. Now I don't know what to carry. You tell me between all these clothes, hmm. what all I should carry and what all I should... Okay, I will put what all you should carry on this side and what you should anyways just dump. Don't even keep it for here. Okay. Okay. This Today, Nana has asked for her daughter's help in packing for her month-long holiday to America. Dump. Hey. Dump. Where? Where? Sorted. Packing was easy. Talking isn't. Since the wedding, Nana and Lavanika haven't spoken about Lavanika's second marriage. Maybe she's waiting for me to start that conversation with her. But uh, I'm not able to gather that courage yet, I think. I still don't think she's accepted me. It'll take time. Over in Indonesia, Winda still has doubts about Arnez's fidelity. papi. Aku tuh nemuin percakapan yang agak-agak aneh lah gitu kayak aku nggak ngerti bahasanya sepertinya apa itu sandi kode gitu. Aku ngerasa kamu sayang sama dia. Itu feeling aku sebagai istri kamu. Emang kamu tanya ada bukti apa sih me? Ya Allah. Enggak negatif. Aku tanya kamu masih sayang nggak sama aku? Wanting to save the marriage, Winda and Arnez saw a counsellor. 
Kamu di Scott Bet. Enggak gitu. Kalau kita tanya cerita apa? Enggak gitu. Dari kita rumah tangga dong. Jadi karena sejak pacaran iya, enggak pernah bilang cerita. Alamak. Iya, nyanyinya kayak gitu, Bun. Jadi aku ah enggak penting amat dijawab gitu. To bridge the communication gap, the Ritongas are back for their second counseling session. The first step, breaking down Arnez's inhibitions. Aku harus mengucapkan. Aku harus mengucapkan. Sayang. Sayang. Cinta. Cinta. Mengasihi. Mengasihi. Kangen. Kangen. Rindu. Rindu. Istriku, Winda. Istriku, Winda. Apalagi saya nggak ada yang ngajarin kalau saya harus gombal. Nggak bisa lah. Dari dulu saya nggak bisa ngegombal orang. Dari, ya sebelum saya kenal Winda, saya pacaran uh, di sekolah, teman sekolah dulu saat masih sekolah. Nggak ada kata-kata kata gombal dari saya, nggak ada. Dan buat saya, orang-orang gombal itu yang senang ngerayu perempuan. But the three words, I love you, mean a great deal to Winda. Because her father had two wives. Karena aku kan nggak deket dulu sama papaku. Aku ketemu dia seminggu sekali, kadang sebulan sekali. Ya aku terlahir dari keluarga yang tidak ada kasih sayang. Masa kecil aku tuh benar-benar membekas banget ternyata. Dan aku nggak sadar itu berimbas loh sama sama sikapku sama suami tuh. Bayangkan. Anda harus mengungkapkan perasaan Anda pada ingat-ingat. Coba dicoba. Bahasa kamu aja sih. Iya, gue lu juga hmm. boleh. Dia manggil aku Nek tuh dari dulu. Nek. Hmm. <laughs> Nek. Apa? Oh, Bunda. <laughs> ya aku sayang sama kamu. <laughs> Coba liatin dia, ibunya anak-anak ini. Oh, ini lima. Lihat anak-anak. Ibu lima anak mulu. Iya, ngelahirin anaknya lima. Iya, coba ibu lima anak. Ya, pernah ini ditanya nih. Ibu lima anak ini sangat menginginkan mendengar iya. bahwa ayah anak-anaknya lah benar-benar mencintai dia. Menyayangi dia. Merindukan dia. Membutuhkan dia. <tuh> Bahkan bila itu adalah sekali kalinya. <tuh> sering tersinggung, sering tersinggungnya kok udah segini sempurnanya masih dia bilang enggak. Jadi itu emang betul-betul dibutuhkan sama Winda istri saya ini. Ngomongnya dari mana ini? Mas Ares mengasihi dia. Masih sekalinya. Coba cerita sama saya, aku mengasihi dia. Aku mengasihi dia. Winda. Winda. Istri. Istriku. Aku mencintai Winda. Aku mencintai Winda. Istriku. Istriku. Aku mau. Kamu yang itu. Ya itu persoalan saya kalau untuk mengucapkan itu, saya mau ngomong, nggak bisa serius langsung mau ketawa muka. Aku harus dipaksa lagi mas, apa apa dipaksa sih? Kan dari sini. Begitu mau ketawa, saya paksain. Jadi mual perut saya. Itu, itu yang aku bilang. Itu yang aku bilang. Coba patah tak matanya dia. Arnez knows his marriage is at stake. It's now or never. Baru ngomong. Aku. Aku. Mengasih kamu. 
mengasihi kamu mencintai kamu mencintai kamu menginginkan hmm. kamu menginginkan kamu seumur hidupku <laughs> seumur hidup pulang ya <laughs> kita jadi kakek nenek jadi lagi dong jadi kakek nenek ini ya, sampai kakek nenek sampai kakek hmm. nenek ya, membesarkan anak-anak terkini anak-anak dengan bahagia ya oh. panjang kan bunda lu <laughs> lihat istrimu sampai terharu hmm. Hmm. itu dia menunggu 17 tahun ya hmm. dan akhirnya dia bisa mendengar Suaminya mencintai, mengasihi, menyayangi, menginginkan untuk seumur hidup. Ya, Pak Winda lihat matanya. Ya, rasakan terus suamiku. Sekarang dia bersungguh-sungguh mengungkapkan perasaannya. Ya, sangat terlihat Mas Arnet dari bahasa tubuh. Ya, Mas Arnet. Makasih Abi. Terjadi suami yang sabar. Walaupun aku banyak tinggal, aku kesel ini lah. Iya, saya mau latihan rencana saya, latihan. Ya nanti mungkin di tempat yang sepi, teriak-teriak. Aku cinta kamu, aku sayang kamu gitu loh. Biar enggak, biar udah terbiasa jadi enggak ketawa lagi. Ever since Silas was retrenched, he has been working for his wife, Elisha, who started a financial technology firm. Peter, Peter, we are going to space together. Yes, we are. Yeah. Yeah. After I fetch, send the kids, and then I come back, and I will need to fetch you ASAP. Daddy. I have to redo everything all over again, like I'm a 20-something-year-old guy. But right now, my body is uh, <laughs> late 40s. He always said that he's not in this field. This is not his industry. He has been mentioning this for about close to a year. I was really pissed off with this saying of, I am not in this industry. To me, it's, I need him to be more independent. It has been a year since Silas joined her firm, and Elisha now expects him to do more. When he joined us, he actually attend all the networking sessions, and he can mingle with somebody who is from US, Russia. So he does have the soft skill which I'm I'm lacking of. So I think he is actually capable. It's just that he doesn't have the confidence. Silas now has to get new clients. On his own. At this networking session, every representative gets just 60 seconds to sell their service. As I mentioned earlier, we do commercial design and build. We would like to assure our customers that appetizer will take care of their food. At the writing, we print to inspire. Take advantage of the HDB to own two properties with zero top-up in cash. Thank you. Finally, it's Silas's turn, and he has come prepared. Good morning, Forty and visitors. Good morning. Good morning. My name is Silas. I'm the co-founder of chartered accounting firm Eboss SG. Have you ever wondered how you can do more to save money for your company but don't know how? Owners who are looking to revamp their accounting processes and achieve efficient cash flow. Thank you so much. I managed to receive a business referral. Not one, not two, but three companies. So I guess it's quite a fruitful um, meeting for today. Silas and Elisha have to close a deal on Thursday night, and he needs someone to mind the kids. His first choice is his mother, who doesn't live with him. She never on her mobile. Call later. Yeah. On Tuesday when I call back, my mom never on the phone. 
When is that call again? My mom never answered the call. Never on the phone also. Same thing for Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Silas's mother has never been uncontactable for more than 24 hours. Silas is now fearing the worst. Silas has lost contact with his mother since Monday night. It's been seven days. Yes, probably. When she, I mean, it's very difficult to trace her when old folks are like, they don't really feel the urgency of switching on the handphones to let other family members know where they are. Moody already. It's not funny, okay? Don't do that. Okay, go away. I don't want to talk to you now. Tonight, however, Wait, Mama. Hey. He finally gets through to her. Turns out, Madam Leong took a trip to Malaysia with her friends. <笑><笑><笑><笑> She said that I didn't pay attention to her. <laughs> uh, yeah. Very tiring sometimes. Just feel that I'm really stretched. <laughs> sometimes I don't even have time to, to be with my mom. <sighs> Still feeling guilty, Silas wants to patch things up. And he is engaging the help of his older son, six year old Jethro. Throw in to be my PR front man. <laughs> uh, it works. <laughs> so, at the end of the day, mm, I can sense also that my mom really loved her two grandchildren. Um, so <laughs> it will make us easy to bridge between me and my mom. Silas decides to take the whole family along for a buffet lunch with grandma. And at the gathering, he reveals to his mom a childhood secret. Come on. Come on, see. You get that young, a pumpkin. Oh, 
气啊，这能会什么力啊？孩子们都在大厅，哎，你放心，我我这个电话现在没没弄免提，就咱们俩在通话。那你自己一个人驾车出去，副驾那儿也没有我，等等我回去啊，就这样啊，拜拜，听话，听话，听话，少抽烟，少抽烟哟，拜拜，啊啊啊啊。啊你们都在这听着呢，什么小猫小狗？狗 In China, 68-year-old Grandma Yu La is dating 71-year-old Meng Xianwu. She is hoping her daughter Liu Man will come to accept her second romance. Ah, 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 别叫我了。The romance has quickly, and the couple have just bought a home together. 这颜色还可以，老年人，就他吧，就他 ，OK， 就是他，就他啊！我抬不动的时候，咱俩抬，在屋里搞卫生，你搞吗？我们要买也买一对也不买一个。对，一对儿漂亮。But there is still one thing lacking: a photo together. Because we both feel that our partners are too old. Oh, especially this man. The man is not like to take a photo with the other person. He is looking at himself so young. He is saying that I am so old, so ugly, so dirty. I also feel that I am so old, so ugly, so dirty. I also feel that I am so old, so ugly, so dirty. I also feel that I am so old, so ugly, so dirty. I also feel that I am so old, so ugly, so dirty. 万一万一，就是我们俩年龄都在这摆着呢，或者是谁先生病，或者怎么样走掉了，什么都没有，合影也没有。一边遛，第二大，真真切切的，咱们俩现在是多老。是多胖就多胖，是多丑就多丑。只要我不嫌你老，你不嫌我胖，呃，什么样就什么样。咱们俩就是真真切切的拍一张，把以前的那些都推翻了，对吧？有感动啊！他对我是一百亿，从各个方面来说，对我来说，对，实心实意的对我，我挺感激他的也。我时机成熟的时候，一定需要去拍。Arnez and Winder's eldest daughter, 16-year-old Lisa, has been in distress because of her parents' marital woes. After finding out his daughter's thoughts, Arnez arranges a family trip to Kota Tua, Jakarta's old colonial town. During the trip, father and daughter have a heart-to-heart chat. Yaitu, Papa, udah lihat video kamu. Kelilipan nih, ya lu. Ternyata diam-diam kamu cuma punya pikiran yang 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 apa yang dewasa ya yang punya punya kamu tuh punya apa sensitif sensitif kamu sama orang kamu bilang mama sok kuat emang bener sok kuat Rico tahu nggak boleh kamu mikirin yang begitu pikiran-pikiran berat nggak ada nanti kamu udah gede bukan anak kecil lagi udah bisa boleh bawa motor ya Cewek-cewek nggak boleh naik motor. Ya, udah beliin mobil. 
Nah, mendingan sekalian mobil. Mobil Grab. In China, Liu Man and her mother, Yula, have been at odds ever since Yula started spending more time with her boyfriend. Liu Man wants to make amends. Tiwa 闭眼吧我闭眼嗯我刚刚刚刚你好这是哪里这是没来过吧一辈子没来过卡拉 录音棚，录音的地方，哦，这才太高兴了。说起我妈唱歌这个事儿，我觉得我挺对不起她的，真的错都怪我，因为我觉得她如果要是反复的提醒我，挺没意思的。先弄一个吧，先弄一个吧。
，我觉得应该多把重心移移动一下，来多关心他一下。不管他曾经跟我发过什么样的脾气，或者我对他有什么样的指责，我是怎么样的爱他，他也是在怎么样的爱我It's Father's Day, and Lavanika and five and a half year old Raghav are preparing a surprise for Vikrant. Yeah, look, dear Dad. D E. It's okay. Um, forget about this. Okay. Ah, ah. Dad. Not that. Dad. D, D, D at the end also. Excellent. I'm so proud of oh, you. I give it to Papa. Macrans. Consciously and unconsciously, he's just been doing things that will. Make Raghav feel that oh yes, this this man here is my father, and uh, to give him that respect, I think I should call him Papa. Happy Father's Day. Okay. Papa. And it just happened, and I mean, in the past uh, at least three weeks or slightly more, I haven't heard him say Vicky or anything else. I've just heard him call him Papa, and I I think that feels really good. It's taken off a huge burden off my shoulders. Who's your dad? Um, my dad, my grand, Rahul, Rahul Papa. Coming uh, from him like that as a five-year-old kid uh, makes a lot of a difference. What's that? Nana got me you. Nana got for me. Yeah. This? Yes. This is nice. She's is just come check? back and we haven't had to interact much, but uh, she bought Vikrant a present. It's oh, it's nice. It's nice and warm. Can I? Can I? No, you can't. It's, it's it's my gift. It was a really nice gesture. She gave me a nice scarf, which yeah, I think I'm gonna wear after about six months. But yeah, definitely it's it's a nice thing. Because without saying we are there for her as parents, we'll always stand by her. Kids are children are children after. Not then. But thank you so much, Raga. This is lovely. If Vikrant was an animal, what would he be? He would be a bully tiger. A bully tiger? Yes, because he always bullies me. How, how does he bully you? He does a, one day he filled so many bubbles in the bubble bath, and he didn't give me those many bubbles. But I had more than him then. He he put the soap in my face. He washed it. 
Let's do a happy Father's Day kiss at least. Thank you so much. What do you think she like to do with the ground? Um, never know. You're going to restaurants, Ani. Ani. Thank you. Do you know more than father and son? I would say uh, they're becoming best friends. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what happened? I told you, I'm scared. Oh, I'm a good dad. I think I'm the best dad around. Idea the what? The Yip household has gathered for a long overdue family lunch. Don't run, please. No, no, no. They only get to sit down for a meal together once every few months. ไม่ไม่เราจะให้ฉันนิ่งตัวเทียวอยู่นะจ๊ะเธอต้องดีเดชเชฟเฮ้ยบัสเกียร์พูดเฮ้ยโอ้ไปหาไปอีกฟิล
，咁樣我哋揾今朝想揾出嚟嘛？如果你讀書學，你有冇信心啊？我有，你唔驚啊？我好似落後啊，咩唔識嗰啲嘢咧？有差別嘅，真嘅。Uh, that really, that really didn't make my mom smile. Uh, it's my family background. My parents, because of their limitation in their education, which put us in that environment. So, there is something like an indirect message that I don't want Jethro to go through what I went through. Hello, Mr. Hong. Your name is. We are applying in the area. Where is the area? Yunmani. Where is it? 近啊！哦，咁啊唔使我帶啦。誒，最好由你帶咯。你不能夠說一直要要孩子注意我啦。如果有時常去他那邊，他就會看到我咯，我也看到他咯。這樣我就沒沒什麼的要求，真的。Silas and his mum come to a truce. While his mum still doesn't want to move in, she has agreed to walk Jethro to school when he starts primary one next year. Okay, Jethro, do you feel tired going to so many enrichments? Yes. Yes. Okay. I am deciding whether to drop some of your enrichments, but I need your help. Can you help me? I need you to remember to ask your teachers in the school when you have a problem. So what do you do? Raise up your hand. Raise up your hand. And what? After raising up your hand, what must you do? Keep quiet. Huh? Keep quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Can you be independent? Do you know what is independent? Okay. Independent means you have to do your homework by yourself. Is it possible? Yeah. Can we promise each other? You want to give me a high five promise? Oh, no, four only. High four cannot. High five. High five, promise. Hmm? Ah, okay. What's this? Iron Man. Iron Man. Okay, go and play. Definitely, it's Raghav that made us a family. We'll fight, fight at least five days a week on Raghav, on whether I'm disciplining him too much or she's not listening to him at, at all, and she's letting him do whatever he wants and things like that. But uh, yeah, it's it's a good thing that uh, we 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 work together. Uh, we 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 part of the same business. We work together at, for for the family. <laughs> Every relationship has its good days and bad days. We are going to fight, but at the end of the day, we know that each of us are going to be our go-to people. No matter how good, bad, or ugly it gets. Let's face it. Let's face it. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? I'm going to put it on the wall. On the wall? On the ship. Can I help you? Yes. Okay, great. Looks perfect. Yeah. Looks awesome. Mm. Looks awesome. Very nice, Raghav. Hmm. This family, yeah, really is a very warm, very warm place. But also, because of the family, it's the most difficult place to be in. Tonight, the Lee family is making plans to fold dumplings for lunch the next day. The last time they arranged a family gathering like this. Grandma Yula left suddenly, much to the unhappiness of everyone else. Uh, 哎呦，我真的是忍痛割爱。反正他说的最多的就是这个男人，就是对他很好，很会照顾人，然后长得很帅。他要是真的，呃，成立了自己新的家庭，我肯定希望他过得幸福呗。哦，你。
heart shape. Oh, it is a heart shape, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, something different. <laughs> yep. So it's okay. a happy meet-up anniversary. Mm. Okay. Huh? Silas and Elisha celebrate six years of married life. I thought my life would be better after I married him. <laughs> um, better I think, without kids, huh? Yeah, definitely better without kids, okay. Every single kid that I have, a new one, <laughs> I will... <laughs> or the, my dream will be further away. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Give me some I think it's a good experience to go through this um, parenting. I never regret that. Hey, are you sure? Really? Tired. Tired. Just only for that few years. Oh, your wife is actually mom. If you bite the bullet and have a very strong teamwork together to, to take care of the child and be there available for them throughout the stage, you see how wonderful it is. Uh, how they grow, how they come back to you when they have a problem. Uh, that, that is the, the sense of, uh, of fulfillment. Yeah. Get one. <laughs> Yang namanya rumah tangga itu tadi tetap. Yang namanya rumah tangga tetap ada namanya masalah. Tinggal gimana kita menyikapinya. Papa dengan mama adalah baik-baik aja hubungan papa sama mama. Nah, mama itulah satu-satunya perempuan, satu-satunya ibu buat kalian anak-anak papa. Gak ada yang lain. Jadi sebenarnya kalau ini aku ketawa. Udah tahu siapa Arnes. Gimana hatinya, walaupun dia nggak mau ngucapin ya. Aku tahu, udah tahu setelahnya, udah tahu kuncinya dia lah. Jadi, aku udah nggak khawatir.